and I was working uh, about what really makes people change. And I was working with the Carl Rogers, the person-centered approach. And I was working with that theory, and I started to say what kind of language we use that produce change in people. So I knew there was the empathy, but I, did, I never realized what really empathy did with people. And I found that Carl Rogers didn't give me the answer to that. But it came to me as a miracle, a book, The New Directions in Client Center Therapy came to my, my, my hand here in Chile. Ten years after, I found there an article, a paper, that was called A Theory of Personality Change. The author, Eugene Gently. And when I read it, <laughs> I got an inspiration that everything affects to me. I mean, when I saw the role of the empathy that went to the feeling process and complete the feeling process that was in the implicit, I started to, to understand something that now I want to show in the week long and why this empathy really works inside of us. I would like to, to share with, with the people some reflections and a workshop about why focusing works. This is very difficult point because many people look the, at the focusing as a miracle and it seems like a miracle. Maybe it is, <laughs> but I would like also to explain it. What is going on inside of us? What happened inside of us when someone is going with me and listen to me things that I can hear from myself? This is something that is an issue that really gives me a lot of passion to understand. Every time I do some focusing, I'm, I'm always surprised with what this miracle uh, bring to. Us. It's a great phenomenon, and I think it, we are just starting to know it. And that is why I believe, because for me, it represents a hope and a very practical way to get into the subjectivity, into the inside of any person. That is something really marvelous that never happened in the history of the humankind. To get in inside is something that really meant to the philosophy and to science, something impossible to do. So focusing for me is a chance, is a hope to be with one person and let him or her to discover his or her identity, his or her matter. What is going on inside of myself? That thing, I mean, the possibility to understand that, to go with that is a very practical way to do it focus and give us that chance so for me it's the great hope for humankind something that really touched me about week long was really that the opportunity we got to live a process i mean an experiential process and a spiritual process uh, a human process when we get into the week long as a, a system, when we go to and get inside, the, the way we interact with people, the way teachers and the people who were in charge of made something very experiential that really we could get a, with other to get known. I mean, the knowledge about the other one. To discover myself is a real experience that we could lead, that is really a way to live in community and a way of to get in, in the deep, in the deep side of the process about discovering ourselves. It's not week long, it's not a place where we go and, and learn about focusing. Week long is a place where we go and live focusing. That is why I, I love it. Other thing is, is the relationship, the way you start to relate to new people and that really they become your brothers and sisters. They, they really become a person that, that maybe you, you could knew for a long and long time. And just because you were there talking with them, maybe later, maybe one hour or two. So the people who sh should go to the week long must be people who really is very interested in focusing, very interested in to get 
the way of how to do it in a better way is a way to be part of a, a community and also is a way of have a hope about humankind.